the return journey. Wherever we go in the world, whoever we meet, some of the needs that human beings have are very similar. Regardless of age, nationality, religion, profession, each human being desires to experience peace of mind, to experience happiness, to experience the exchange of love and respect within relationships. And this indicates that our true nature is peace. We are naturally drawn towards that which we have experienced in the past. Peace is the true nature of the human soul. When we move away from that experience, then we desire to return to that experience. And hence, the journey to peace is a return journey. And since it is a return journey, therefore, it is possible for each person to make this journey. In today's modern world, it has become normal to live in the world of doing and the world of having. And by seeing other people also living in that world, in that dimension of life, this is what has become the norm. However, that which is normal is not necessarily that which is natural. Normal is a word we use to describe what the majority does. And when the majority starts doing something different, we simply call it the new normal. But that which is natural always stays within us. That does not change. What is natural to the human soul is peace. And hence, the deepest desire of the soul is to be at peace. The return journey back to peace starts with myself taking a few moments to dwell upon the deepest and most important aspects of life, to know myself, to reflect upon the important questions. Who am I? Where am I going? And so let us spend a few moments to explore the inner journey, the return journey. I sit by myself and I sit with myself. I want to be and experience my true self, my eternal self. I want to make the return journey back to peace. I want to allow my mind to once again experience the freedom that comes from simply being my eternal self. The mind has been caught up in the realm of having and the realm of doing and it became a habit to exist within those realms. But now I choose to step back from having and from doing and just experience 
being I. I bring into my awareness once again my original and eternal form and that is the form of the being of light. Picture the self as this being of peaceful light in the center of the forehead. Just be with the self. free from any burden, free from any responsibility, no pulls, no pushes, just returning to the thought, I am. Allow yourself the freedom to not put any pressure upon the self. Allow the mind to be light. Allow the mind to be in this very natural, childlike state of innocence. These two simple words are the most powerful words to return to being. Simply, I am. And when I experience I am, I experience stillness. I experience calmness and the natural quality of peace rises up and emerges from deep within the soul. I am. And now I choose to add another word to I am. I am light. Experience that light. Feel that light. I am still. Feel the beauty of stillness of thought. I am peace. Allow the mind to dwell upon these thoughts. In turn, one by one, and as the mind dwells upon this eternal truth, the beauty of the soul gradually emerges. I am filled with power. I am filled with the energy to keep my mind stable. And I carry this stability with me as I re-enter the world of actions, interactions, relationships and responsibilities.